So we have the ID Tech X here with a CDT. So you have and uh, this is Wallace Power right here for your display. So hello, so who are you? Hi, my name is Alexander Doust. I am the technical lead of the Flexible OLED project at CDT. So this is a flexible OLED display right here? Yeah, this is what we call a human device interface. Uh, what we've done is we've integrated touch sensor to this particular device. As you can see, touch the device. Maybe on glass that we can have 10 years And it's a very bright, uh, but this is a segmented display, right? Yeah. Uh, no, it's not a segmented display. These are fixed icons. I mean, I don't actually, uh, and, uh, actually, and these are. We can give you some. We can send you some. No, I can yeah. send you a functional device. As you can see, oh, no. well, that's what we're doing. We've given probably over 40 uh, of those little okay. demonstrators okay. to uh, OLED. Yeah, just, uh, just a fraction yeah, of a right millimeter. So it's right there, flexible yeah. millimeter. And it's what is a, fully flexible. And you have this one you can show also? Yep, these are also. Um, so these are what we call a graphic equalizer with a seven segment display. Also fully flexible, and we can make these in, in all the, uh, the RGB and W colors, as you can see we have an example of white. So, is it possible to have the full what's called matrix or something like that, where you can display anything people want? Or um, So then you're talking about a, a, a display as in a TV display, this is not what we're doing, these are fixed icons, this is a, a low cost, low information content. OLED on flexible substrates. So what's the use case? What, you what is this example? Um, here we're just trying to uh, make people aware of the possibilities. Um, so we have a few examples. Obviously this is a, a visitor badge for the conference, for example. Uh, but equally you can have a, a transportation sign that could give you your residual balance. So these are just product ideas that we, we, we want to share with people here at the conference. Uh, to generate some potential credit card? For example, it could be a credit card. Um, it could, it, it could be, it could, it could be a, a card for validating a, an entrance into a sporting event or a, or a, or a ticket or a concert. Nice. So there's no battery in there. There's no battery in there. And it gets the power through NFC. Through NFC. And so Samsung Galaxy phones also have this NFC function. So all these demonstrators that you see here would also work with a Galaxy phone. And. Uh, so do you have lots of customers so far? Or? Yeah, we have. Let's, let's look over here. You have this uh, also designed like that? Yeah, so here what we do is we can just say, can we just print in white and we can put color filters over the top and that gives the customer the ability to have many, many different colors uh, as part of their product, depending on what they're interested in using this technology for. So you're in Cambridge in the UK? Yep, that's right. And uh, what kind of customers do you have so far? So we're generating customers, people that are looking to use these products in white goods, for example, in consumer electronics, fridges, uh, washing machines, that, that kind of uh, application area. So it's good for showing numbers? Because you can, you can actually do all the numbers with this? Or? You can do whatever logo you want. Okay. You know, we just put numbers down as an example. But it can adjust for the amount of money that actually did. Yeah, in this case, in this particular example, the, the numbers are fixed. But as you can see in the example here, you know, we could make, we could have multiple of these seven segments, and they can make up any any number. You would need a little uh, microcontroller or something in there. That there is already one in there. That could be programmed to do all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Secure. Yeah. Oh. And uh, so, what's the price? This kind of display. So there's no price because we're not in production. We're at the moment looking to uh, get customers and basically get this into uh, into full scale production. All right. Together with partners. Is it uh, unbreakable? Uh, Is yeah, it flexible. Yeah, it's flexible. I haven't it's managed to break one. It's just plastic, basically. Uh, yeah. So very thin. How 300 power micron. Consumption? Uh, depending on the color, but the power consumption is a few milliwatts per centimeter squared. So you need a little bit of power in the device? Yep. Or NFC is enough? More. NFC then, is enough. And then you have like this. How long did it take you to do one for ID Tech X? Well, I mean, from, from developing the concept to final delivery of, of this demonstrator was a few weeks. But uh, that's because we had a lot of other stuff on the go at the same time. All right, so potentially... But potentially within a few weeks. Any, any, anything, any of these could be made within a few weeks. Any new designs, any um, anything that anybody would want. There could potentially be uh, millions and millions of people having this soon, right? That's, that's, our, that's our ambition, yes.